That's right, I'm building an air engine. I've got this little 23, 25, I think it's 25cc, yeah, 25. 25cc Dormar PB 250 um, leaf blower engine. It's been sitting in my shed for a long time and I've never found out what to use it for. Um, I was going to chuck it out, but then I came across this video um, by C Change For Us. I'll put it in the link um, video. He had the video of this air engine which he just made out of a um, weed eater engine or whip snipper engine. Um, just using, just pretty much directly connecting the air up to here, spark plug hole. But before that, he just put a tube, like 20 centimeters, 30 centimeters of tube. So it's uh, your piston doesn't go like down and then it doesn't go up and then just pushes back down. It uh, goes around. It sort of frees up the um, instead of filling this whole cylinder up with air, it fills up like the tube as well, so it can complete the cycle. So it doesn't pressure it down so much. Um, so I have to get that tube. Uh, the auto store was open. Uh, was closed when I went to go get my stuff. Um, I got this stuff at the hardware store. It's a quarter inch. Uh, this is a female quarter inch female plug thingo, and that's a male one, which just goes into the spark plug hole. I've got some plumber's tape or um, ceramic. No, not ceramic. What do they call it? Teflon tape. Teflon or plumber's tape around there just so it's a tight fit so it's in there pretty good so in there nice and strong um, and then I got this that part goes onto my compressor you just need to get what sort your compressor um, what bit it is that goes on that bit and then yeah, you put that onto your tube on your compressor this part you put a hose from here to there and then basically you just start it up um, on the video, his started by itself. Um, he didn't put it on full compression stroke. He put it slightly down on the stroke, and it started. Um, I'll just show you where this little pipe goes, where this clip goes. And this is my new compressor, by the way. I don't think I made a video of it. Maybe I did. I can't remember. Hold on. You're going to be staring at the ground. Sky. Me. While I do this. Okay. So it slips in like that. That's my little connection. And then the tube will go on here. And like 30 centimeters of automotive tubing. And then it goes on this part. And then you just start it. And hopefully it should work. According to this other guy. And that's all there is to it. Um, he was running, I think, at 60 psi. Mine gives out um, around 90. Well, it'll give out like 130, but um, continuously about 90 while it keeps in generating. So I'll be able to run the engine for a while before it stops. And yeah, that's um, what I'm doing tomorrow. I'm going to weld up my frame and get like the seat and all that sort of stuff hopefully make a bit of progress on that and then later that day I'll go to the um, car shop and get some automotive tubing hook that up and make sure that runs hopefully it does and I'll make a little video of it running and yeah pretty excited to work on my go-kart a bit more hopefully get it running by uh, end of this week or maybe end of next week depending how slow or fast it goes and yeah, that's the air engine. See you later.